Will the streets of America's most crowded cities one day be full of small vehicles like this one? So even though the vehicle is bouncing, you don't really feel it pitching forward or back very much. It's very level, very stable. General Motors, better known for big SUVs and family cars, and Segway, the company that created and produces two-wheel personal transports, have come up with this. It's called Puma for short, which means personal urban mobility and accessibility. Energy efficiency is fashionable, and reducing your environmental footprint is fashionable. And I also think it's fashionable to be polite to other people when you're driving. They're quiet, they're clean. The two-wheel, two-seat vehicles are electric. The project is not just about being smaller and greener. The idea is for it to plug into a vast communications network that would allow vehicles to interact with each other, regulate the flow of traffic, and prevent crashes. If you are used to the daily grind of your commute and you'd rather be doing something else, you can allow the vehicle to drive itself and you can take advantage of that time. The 300-pound prototype runs on a lithium-ion battery and uses Segway's characteristic two-wheel balancing technology. It has dual electric motors. Puma can reach 35 miles an hour and can run 35 miles on a single charge. Company officials won't say what the Puma would cost, and there's no timeline for producing them for the general public. For GM, it could be a sign that the faltering company really is changing for the future. Matt Friedman, The Associated Press.